Saturday night, everybody was talking about the two big plays for Miami at the start of the second half. Uh, those plays, while Louisville didn't line up to them great, they were actually set up in the first half here. This is the first drive of the game. You see the unbalanced set, tight end here, three receivers, a back, nobody in the middle of the field for Louisville. Edge defender here. A consistent box to what they gave the unbalanced all night. So you watch here. This is not a successful play. But it's information for offensive coordinator Rhett Lashley. Again, same look, same formation, same look from the Louisville defense. Again, a negative play. So if I'm Louisville at halftime, what am I thinking I need to stop? Well, here's some motion. And I just throw the quick now screen out here. Picks up 10 yards for Miami. And then here's the unbalanced look. I throw the screen out there. Again, pick up another first down. So if I'm talking Louisville at halftime, and here's again in the first quarter, quarterback power out of the unbalanced look. Three receivers up here. Tight end, back, quarterback power. Aggressively meeting the back in the backfield, making bounce, make the play. So if I'm Louisville at halftime, I'm thinking I need to stop this screen. That's the only thing that's been successful, right? So the motion to the screen, look at all the play you get out here. Eyes to the screen. Then we're just going to a simple zone back this way, and then the Louisville edge defender loses the edge. And then you got a foot race to the end zone. And this dude can roll. And we just showed earlier, quarterback power. This guy met the back three yards in the backfield. He sees the same look. He's going to do it again. These guys made the play, right? They're playing aggressive downhill. Well, we're just going to slip him out. And this could be something they held. You know, you want you like to script stuff sometimes at the beginning of the game and then hold stuff through the second half so you can't get an adjustment. So maybe this was something that Miami held for the second half after they saw how Louisville was going to play their unbalanced looks.